Taxes are something that most of us regard as something very dry or a painful personal matter. But taxes are very much in the news again with all the discussions of corporations such as Google, Amazon, and Starbucks managing, shall we say, their tax liabilities in the United Kingdom. The reason we're seeing uh, cases like this more and more in the press has to do with the fact that intangible assets are a bigger and bigger chunk of what businesses are worth. And in principle, you can have the ownership of those assets being assigned anywhere. So this is a problem that unfortunately is chronic, is probably not going to go away. I think that obviously, yes, if Europe had a harmonized system of tax rates, that would reduce within Europe tax competition. On the other hand, given that the British currently have amongst the lowest tax rates of any major European economy, and given the orientations of George Osborne as Chancellor, it seems very unlikely that tax harmonization is going to be on the cards anytime soon. While I don't think a unitary tax is possible right now, I do think that ultimately the solution for managing, if not eliminating this problem, probably does have to go along the lines of legislative remedies, changes in tax rates. I think that anytime you make this simply a moral issue, that's an invitation to people to ignore the issue altogether. I think a better attitude is to remember that businesses do create value, businesses do grow jobs, etc. And while there is some notion that businesses should be paying their fair share, anytime the discussion shifts to punishing businesses, I think there's a little bit too much risk of seeing business itself as somehow the enemy. One of the things that one needs to do is close down some of the most egregious loopholes that exist. Continuing the work, uh, there are still financial havens that are not compliant with the last set of reforms that were attempted. Keeping the pressure up on them is very, very important. I think that the OECD has a role to play in reminding governments in the OECD and elsewhere of the importance of tax simplification as well as clearer tax laws in actually making the tax system work better. If you look at the US tax code, for instance, it's something about this thick that is full of special interests. When you set up a system like that, it's inevitably going to have loopholes, etc., and people will exploit those loopholes. So I think tax simplification, as well as tightening up on some of these instances of evasion, is very important.